Hi everyone, this is Lovecraft the Girl. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a weekly spread in my mini happy planner. For this week, I chose a free printable by Victoria Thatcher, and the printable that I chose is this one right here. I thought it was a really, really nice printable. I was actually going to use this in my old um, planner, but I decided to hold on to it to when I felt like it was the right time to use it. And for me, this is the right time to use it because this printable reminds me of me and how I feel and what I do when I'm looking for printables, when I'm um, making notes on what I'm going to be printing out for what week I'm going to use certain printables and so I love this and I thought it was a perfect one to use for today so continue watching and see how I put this printable together So I'm going to be doing this spread pretty much the same way I do the spread in my classic happy planner. Um, this is a Victoria Thatcher free printable, which I don't think I mentioned it in my intro, but I wanted to make sure you guys knew. Um, so I'm going to be doing the layout just the same way I do it, where I work from the bottom and work my way up. Now, when it came to the washi tape, though, I'm so used to always using thinner washi, but being that the um, printables are made for like an Erin Condren, and so the boxes are smaller, and of course, these boxes are a lot, you know, bigger. Uh, I decided to go with bigger washi tape, just normal size washi to take up a lot of the room. So that's what I'm doing here. As you can see, I'm using big washi tape just to see. Um, I'm actually playing around and see what works well with this uh, spread because I want to see whether or not I should be doing that or I should cut it in half. And I'm doing the same thing here for the top part. Now for the top part, it's a different washi tape. It's not the same exact one from the ones I use in the middle. This one's um, pretty much almost the same, but if you look at it carefully, it's not. And so I wanted to see if this would look good with putting the days of the week at the top and just having a little bit of that washi come out. And I'm actually okay with it. I actually like the way it looks um, after I was done doing this. Um, I really looked at it carefully and I thought it was pretty good. So for the second page, as you know, I always place that big sticker at the bottom. Now this big sticker is a little too big, as you can tell it actually covered up one of the holes. So I will um, trim that little hole out, make sure it's there so I can place it into the planner properly. But I don't want to go any smaller, so I print this printable at 70%. Um, I think the boxes fit perfectly well into the boxes the boxes in on the page so if i go any smaller i think i would have a lot more white space on the sides maybe it won't look that great and i don't want it to go any smaller either because i feel like you lose a lot of the um, look to your printables so sticking to this percentage i'm going to keep it this way and i'm just going to have to tweak you know if i have to cover you know if the hole gets covered i'll just have to cut it out and make sure it's there so i might have to do extra little things here and there but it's not a big deal and Overall, I actually like the way it came out. So here's the final to put together the weekly spread and I love the way this came out. This came out really, really nice. It's super cute. Um, the washi tape was different. Um, I wasn't gonna use that thick washi, I was gonna use a thinner one, but I thought, try something new. This is a whole new layout. This is a whole new printable. This is a whole new planner. So everything is new for me. I'm still trying to figure this planner out and the way I'm gonna uh, work with this and what works for me. So, so far I'm just playing around and see what I want to do for the next week. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.